Hey Faithers, I just wanted to take a moment and uh, bring you into a little practice that I do once a month as I'm heading into Solon. I love to pull off to a scenic rest area that overlooks a lot of the mountains that we have surrounding us in the central main area and the reason why I do it is because it helps me gain perspective. You see I have a very uh, standard routine. I do pretty much the same thing almost every single day and go to the same places, drive the same streets. Everything's very predictable for all that I um, have going on in my life. And so I, I think that's a good thing for the most part. The Lord gives us the ability to, to create routine and, and gives us that, the, the ability to do the things that we're supposed to do without having to overthink it and stuff. So that's all great. But, but what I love to do is pull out and look at these mountains and be reminded of the fact that God is bigger than the little world that I've created for myself or even the little world that he's put me in for the time being. To understand that God is doing some things that are vastly bigger than what I often give him credit for. Faithers, I hope that you understand that when the leadership of the church is putting out new challenges, new ideas and ways for us to uh, reach the communities around us and stuff, it's not just so that we can have more people come to our church or be known as a church that's busy about the community and things. All those things are great byproducts of what we're doing, but ultimately it's because the Lord has created us to see the bigger world around us. And so by us investing our lives in the people around us, stretching our comfort zones, acting in faith and all those kinds of things, what we've, what we've essentially done is expanded our horizons to the world that he's put around us that we often don't give ourselves the chance to witness. And so as I come and I look at these mountains and I just sit in the peace and the quiet of all that God has created, I'm reminded how big God really is because I've shrunk him based on my needs of the moment or my frustrations of the day. And when I see that there's a bigger world around me, it helps me put those things in perspective. So as we look to grow as a church, as we look to move forward, uh, the thing that we're trying to do, the thing that we're really striving for, is to expand our horizons and to be caught in uh, the path and the pattern of a great and vast God who has so many different things prepared for his children. So we're encouraging you all to enter in, to take part, to stretch your comfort zones, to act in faith, so that the Lord will let us see, even just a glimpse, even just for a mere pull-off on the side of the road, what he's up to. I'm praying for you, I'm praying for us, praying that the Lord continues to show us what he's up to. I love you guys.